Hey guys and welcome back. Today I'm going to share with you all a really quick and delicious baked turkey. I'm doing this one on my rotisserie but of course you can make it in your oven. It's going to be really easy and really delicious. So we're going to start by making a dry rub and I'm using kosher salt. I'm going to go in with Cajun seasoning and I'll use two teaspoons of that with we'll half a teaspoon of salt and I'll use four teaspoons of this Caribbean citrus blend. It's a really delicious blend for protein. I'm just going to give that a quick mix. Set that aside and to my cleaned and washed turkey I'm going to go on with some of, this, some of the Angostura aromatic bitters. If you think turkey is really gamey you guys have to try rubbing down your turkey with this before doing anything else. Then we're going to add on that dry rub and rub it in the inside and outside properly throughout, making sure it's properly coated. Then I'm going to cover this and set it in my refrigerator for 12 hours. It's a dry brine process, really easy. It doesn't have to be a full 12 if you don't want to. You can go like five hours. It's still going to be amazing. So now we're going to make a green seasoning blend with some pimento peppers, some garlic, some shadow benny, fresh shadow benny, and I'll also go in with some cilantro. This is called cilantro. We're gonna go in with some cilantro now. Or if you don't have that, or you don't like it, you could use some flat leaf Italian parsley. In goes fine thyme, and if you wanted to add some rosemary in here, you can also. Once it's nice and fine, we're going to go ahead and Add it to our butter. We have butter, I have golden rye, and I have tomato paste. I'm adding on some fresh lemon zest and that green seasoning mixture. Now I'm going to go in with some more of that Cajun seasoning and the Caribbean citrus seasoning. This is just a really quick recipe in time for New Year's, and I hope you guys have the chance to give it a try. If not, save it for Thanksgiving and Christmas next year. Give this a mix. You want to mix all of those dried seasonings and herbs into your butter. And trust me, the golden ray adds a really delicious flavor. The tomato paste is there to give it some color. Now I used the butter and I rubbed it all on the inside, the cavity, the skin, under the skin. I tied up the bird and now I'm just brushing that extra butter all over. Then I'm going to place it on my rotisserie and allow it to cook. It's going to bake for 12 minutes per pound when you're making yours. Once it's beautiful and it's golden and it reads an internal temperature of 170 degrees Fahrenheit, it's ready to be eaten but you want to cool it down before enjoying so i hope you guys enjoyed this quick recipe thank you so much for watching